Alright guys, so here are the gears that I use for moto vlogging. So of course, the first thing that we got is the helmet. Also the second thing is of course the camera. So I got the GoPro Hero 5 Black. Uh, this is the camera that I uh, always use for vlogging, um, for you know, anything. Aside from this cell phone that I use uh, for capturing this video. And of course, we have a solution on how we are going to mount this one to our helmet on this part here. So I have bought this one from Lazada before COVID. Uh, this is just around 250 maybe or 300 uh, if online. So I see this thing as well being sold or being there's a selling on this online. This is somewhere around 400 to 500 meet up uh, somewhere here in Davao City so the first thing that we're going to do is uh, we're gonna set it up here inside the helmet all right A few moments later. Alright, so this is how it looks like, guys. So basically, um, there's a strap inside. So, there's a lock here. So, there's a lock here inside of it. Uh, you can tighten it up by pulling outside and lock it in. And also, outside. Uh, good thing that this particular model has a hole here. So, we can put Mapalasot yung strap and uh, you need to make sure that when you close this uh, visor here you're still able to lock it fully so still uh, it's tightened and now it's time for us to uh, put the camera alright so yeah simply lang so we'll get the GoPro here so there's like a mount on this part, so we just need to unscrew the lock. Alright, and how it's look, it looks like. So we just need to uh, put the camera here. And lock it up. Good to go. Alright, so I calibrate the knock and make sure that the angle is perfectly horizontal. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so that's gonna be our final setup. So we'll check it out and let's try to wear this. Alright, so yeah guys, this is how uh, my Moto vlogging setup looks like Alright, so you can also open Your Helmet here Alright, so the downside for this setup is that uh, You're not Gonna be getting a uh, Good audio Because uh, This particular GoPro has an issue with audio Of course, this is common to mostly GoPros from You know, Hero 5 uh, Hero 6 uh, maybe if you have Hero 7, uh, the audio quality of that is a little bit better. And also with the GoPro Hero 8. And um, yes, the ideal setup for this is you need to purchase a mic adapter and as well as the uh, mic uh, 
for you to be able to get a better audio when you're vlogging. Um, you're vlogging particularly on that kind of setup. Uh, the audio is not nice. So you need to spend another money specifically for you to be able to get a good audio. So that's another expense. But there's also another setup though I'll introduce you which you'll get a better st stability when you do vlogging and also that's better if you're gonna get um, it's it's better also for good audio because in that kind of setup your your camera is behind the helmet you're not gonna be able to get a good audio because uh, the blocking so you're in your you're talking inside and you're, you're just kind of a wobbling sound or whatever it was just not clear on the audio so I'm gonna introduce you another setup which is uh, much better m more stable and I'll show it to you alright guys so this is definitely the setup which I'm talking about uh, this is actually a body strap where you can strap it on, on your body uh, this is not mounted on the helmet so same same thing I uh, just need to um, attach your GoPro on this part here so same idea okay so just make sure that you attach your GoPro here all right it's, uh, definitely set up and I'll show you how how it works all right so this is how this body strap works so after you're able to plug it in, set it up, you just need to untie it here, unplug it, because you need to wear this to your body. So just to set up, it, it's like a police uh, gear where they attach their camera to their body or their their pistol or something like that. So this is how it works. So um, I'm uh, waiting. I'm doing this kind of position. So this is how the camera is attached to the body. And uh, good, uh, good thing about this, or positive thing about this, is when you're riding, so, uh, your body is stable. It's not part of the the head, so it can capture stable footage. And there's like a bumpy ride. It's not that you know not the bump it's not capturing a lot of bumps and also good thing about this is that it's not blocking so if you can see the camera setup it's the camera's behind the mouth on this case it's it's under all right so that was it so hope you enjoyed the video and you learned something from it or from me and i hope you subscribe um i need to end up my video because my daughter just woke up and she's very noisy I can't continue with everything. <laughs> Alright, thank you and bye for now.